What's going on everybody? So today I am going to show you how to bench press without a bench. Now, I know what you're thinking, how the heck is that possible? Well, what I'm going to be discussing today is the floor press, which is a awesome alternative to the bench press. Now, when I first got my garage gym, I did not have a bench for about six to seven months, and all I did was floor press, and my max went up about 10 to 15 pounds. So it is a great alternative, and for a lot of you, it's gonna be fantastic for you to change up your variation, get a new stimulus, and create a new adaptation for yourself. And it'll also increase your strength. So for the floor press, it's extremely simple. All you're doing is laying down on the floor. All right, so now the first thing I wanna cover is foot position. There's two different ways that you can do this. You can either have your legs straight or you can bend your knees and put your feet flat on the floor. What's the difference? The difference is going to be with your legs straight, you don't get any leg drive. It's going to be a lot more difficult in that position. If you put those feet flat on the floor and bend those knees, you can get a good arch in the back, a good setup, and you can drive those feet into the floor, and that'll be a little bit more similar to the bench press. Now, if you're going to be benching for quite a while without a bench, I highly suggest that you switch between the two of those. That'll allow for two different stimulus and two different adaptations for you to create. And inevitably, you will increase your bench press just by doing that. So the under rack is gonna be extremely similar to the regular bench press. So you're taking in your big belly breath, you'll unrack the bar. What's going to be different is now your elbows are gonna hit the floor and you have to make sure that they hit evenly or it'll throw you off balance, right? It'll mess up your lift. So as he brings it down, he's actively pulling those elbows in, engaging the lats, elbows will touch the floor, and then he'll press back up, right? Go ahead and rack it. So this, whenever you go back to using a regular bench press, this will be beneficial for you because you're gonna really have to focus on pulling those elbows in to your, towards your sides as you're coming down, so that way you keep the bar under control and you hit your elbows evenly. Now that is how you bench press without a bench. It's very simple, just use the floor press. Now I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you have any comments, feel free to drop them below. I'll help you guys out in any way that I can. Otherwise, go ahead, like, subscribe, and share this video with all of your lifting buddies. And until next time, stay strong. Boom.